Hello, I'm Kenny Lowry. Today we're going to take a look at a solar pump and the solar battery, solar panels right here. Uh, this is basically a little kit that's made to work together. Now we've tried solar through the years. I've been doing this for almost 24 years. Tried different solar setups. Didn't really like them. Uh, even a couple of years ago we bought some great big solar panels, a great big uh, marine cycle battery, and uh, we had that set up. Just wasn't problem free. Didn't like the way that it works. This is a neat little system. Uh, I think it's going to be something that's not complicated. It's made to work together. You got your solar panel, which charges the battery, and the battery runs the, the pump. So um, that way you're you're actually running from this. Now the the one thing about this setup that I like more than any others I've seen, you can control the amount of flow of energy going to the pump, which is going to control, of course, your pump and shoot how high it shoots the water. Now there it is maxed out. Uh, we've been testing this here for a couple of months. Uh, maxed out like that, uh, it would burn, it would, it would last about two hours. That's about what it lasts. But if you take that feature right there and turn it down to about halfway, so that your plume of water is still a sufficient plume of water, about right there. So that's about half. Uh, still got a nice flow to it, still getting sound from it. I know here at, here at our retail location it stays on all day. You got the panel is actually charging the whole time you're running it, charging the battery, the battery's fully charged. We'll get seven hours use out of it. We close at five o'clock so I turn it off. I think in the evenings if you're at work, like most people, and you come home in the evenings, if, if your system's been off all day, your, your panel's been charging the battery all day, you have a fully charged battery, uh, you should get a, a few hours of uh, run time out of it at that half speed. So enough to get you through the evening. So you let it charge up during the day, turn it on in the evenings when you get home from work, and it'll run until probably dark, dark uh, when it gets dark outside or uh, maybe even a little bit beyond that. So, uh, and then the next day you make sure your system's off, it recharges the, the battery again, and you kind of get use out of it that way. Uh, if it's a bright sunny day, I think if it turned uh, the flows correct where you're not discharging the battery and this is charging enough to keep it full, you probably get most of the day out of it. So those are things you got to do on your end, depending on where you're at in the country, how much sunshine you get. Today the cloudy, dreary day here. It's not going to be charging as much. Now I've got this set back here, but normally we set it right out in the sun. So it's getting maximum uh, charging on it. Uh, right now I'll grab the uh, system. I do want to point this out though. Uh, this has an on and off switch. You see I just turned it off right there, which is a, a big advantage. I think that's a big advantage on it. So right now I just turned it back on. You come back on, like I said, you do have that flow control on there, but there again, it's going to be using more power. Uh, there is also another feature on here. I'm not really sure why you'd want that, but it'll come on uh, every 10 minutes out of every hour. So I don't know why you'd want to run it 10 minutes out of every hour, but that is on there. So you do have your, your on and off switch, your uh, flow control, and it also has an indicator here lets you know if your battery's charged up. So right now, let's just take a close up look at it. This is going to work pretty smoothly together. That's the thing that makes us want to be able to market this that is not something that's pieced together and maybe not the components don't work together. This actually works together very well. Now the solar pump's right down in there. Your solar panel, of course. And then your little battery backup. And I think you can see those uh, indicators there on the front. If you're expecting it to work like electric electricity, though, of course it's not going to do that. But for solar, I think this is the best that we've ever tested. As always, if you have any questions about any of our products, you can reach us at 540-948-2239 or email us boulderfountain at gmail.com.